Hey guys, it's AG Twins. We just wanted to post a quick haul video because we went to the American Girl Doll benefit sale in Madison, Wisconsin. So we were super excited because we went on Sunday and that's the day where everything is like a huge reduced price and a lot of it is half off so it's a huge deal and lots of great savings there. So when we went on Sunday we were originally going to wait in line um, because they start handing out tickets for free at 8 for you to get into the warehouse at earliest 9. So, but while we were waiting in line, two very nice people walked up to us and they had tickets for the 8.15 time slot that they had extras from. So they were giving them away. So we each got two tickets, or we got two tickets so the both of us could go into the sale at 8.15 so that we could get there before a lot of the stuff was gone. So we got free tickets for the 815 time slot, time slot to walk into the warehouse. That was pretty great. So we're just going to show you all the stuff that we got at the benefit sale. So the first thing that we got is this outfit. This is the double bow dress. And on Saturday this was $20, but we went on Sunday so it was half off and it was $10. So this outfit includes the blue dress a headband, and the shoes. And these shoes are actually on sale right now on AmericanGirl.com under sale, but just the shoes. But this outfit is actually pretty old because I think it retired in 2014 or 13, something like that, because it actually came with a charm. And you guys probably can't see, but this is the rectangle kind charm. It's green. So I was excited about that because I don't have very many charms for my charm necklace, so I got a charm with my double bow dress. Um, the next thing that we got was $18 on Saturday, but I got it for $9, and this is a school stripes dress. And this one did not come with a charm, but that's okay. But it's really cute. It just comes with the dress. And then it has these tennis shoes. They're super cute. They can fold up, and they have the design there. So I really like that. So the next thing that I got is Ivy's accessories and I was surprised these were there because they've been there for like two-ish, one or two years. I know for sure they were there last year at the benefit sale. So they were there again and there were still some left at the second day of the sale. So these were $8 the first day and then they were actually reduced to $2 on the second day. So I got these for two bucks. So this just includes Ivy's little purplish pink beret, her bag, and then it also has her Chinese coin. And I was kind of disappointed that it didn't come with the earrings, but I knew it wouldn't have the earrings, but I was okay with that. So I'm just going to move on to the dolls that I got. Um, these are my sisters, and she will come in later at the video and do hers. But I got two dolls. I got Grace, which was last year's year doll, Girl of the Year 2015. And I'm super excited that I got her because I've been wanting her, but I didn't get her while she was the year doll. So she does come with her charm bracelet. Right here, let's get it out. So she does come with her charm bracelet that you get with her at the benefit sale. So this is Grace. She's super pretty. All, almost all of them had their meat style in, and I just love the highlights in her hair. And also, I got one with pierced ears at the benefit sale. Quite a few of them have pierced ears. So I just asked the um, the volunteer behind the table who was stacking them out as people were taking them. And I said, hey, do you have any with pierced ears? And she said, I don't know. They just kind of come up. So I stood at the table until one came up with pierced ears. She was like, oh, here's one with pierced ears. And I was like, oh, thanks. So you get the doll. You can wait and get a doll with pierced ears. And it doesn't cost any more than it does for a regular doll at the benefit sale. So that, so then that way you don't have to pay for a doll to get their ears pierced after you buy them. So on the second day, Grace was $75. And the next doll I got is a Truly Me doll. And I got number 59. And I really like her. I've been wanting her for a little bit too. Um, I kind of thought her hair was longer. It looks longer in pictures in the magazine. But I, it looks shorter than I thought it was, but I still like her a lot. And again, she has her ears pierced. But the thing is with the Truly Me dolls, it's different than with Grace. With Grace, when they come up with pierced ears, the volunteers just put them out on the table. But with the Truly Me dolls, um, they stack them behind the table 
so that you have to ask for one with pierced ears if you want it. So you can just walk up and be like, hey, are there any 59s with pierced ears? And, the, and they actually did have a 59 with pierced ears, and I think she was the last one with pierced ears. So I was really lucky we got that early time slot. And she has the blue crystal earrings from the new ear piercing set that they use. They don't use the old one anymore. We get like six. There's only four, and they have a blue one. But I like it a lot because it matches the new me outfit. Now, they also had this meat outfit for sale that I was going to get, but since it came on this doll, then I didn't get it. But I like the new meat outfit a lot. Okay, so as you probably figured out, we're AG twins, so that first half of the video was what my sister got, and now we're going to move into what I got. Just a little disclaimer, we forgot to say this in the beginning, but we both paid for this all with our own money, so... Not trying to brag or anything. We've been saying that for this for a while and have been really looking forward to this event. The first thing that I got is Samantha's Holiday Set. When I saw this on the price list, I was thrilled and I just really hoped it was going to be their second day. And it was, so I got it for $21 and I totally think it was worth that price. I'm so excited to open it. It comes with a little note from American Girl. It says, we work hard to make sure our high-quality accessories and reproductions are accurate and true to life. Some are made with fragile materials like glass, porcelain, and stoneware, so please be careful. Every detail is designed to make our products as authentic as possible and to make sure that they can be cherished by girls 8 and up for many years to come. I've never seen that before in a package, so that's a really nice little touch. Oh my gosh! The first piece in the set is this little lace bow. It's so cute. It comes already tied in a bow, so you don't have to worry about putting it into a perfect little bow. It comes on a ponytail holder, so it's really easy to put in. It's just lace. There's no lining or anything to it. It's just lace tied into a bow. That might be my favorite part of this whole set. It's so cute. The next piece in this set is the dress. The dress is red plaid. It's so cute. Very Christmassy. This is probably actually the most historically, accu historically accurate outfit in Samantha's Be Forever collection because of the neckline like that and the long sleeves and the length of the dress. So I really like this one. Again, the bow's already tied on the back. So that's nice because I can't tie bows for my life. The next thing in this set are these shoes. They're little velvet boots with bows on the front. They just velcro up the back. It also comes with black tights. Just plain black. It has a little napkin placemat kind of thing. You put that on top of this little silver tray, I think. There's this little plate. It has gold around the edge. I don't know if the camera picks that up. Cute little rose print. Also oh, comes with this teacup. I wish it had a pattern on the outside, but it's just white and all the design is on the inside of the cup. It's a little picture that matches the cup and the plate. And the little lid. It also comes with these, I don't know what they're called, the food treats, it just calls them on the box. There are three of them. They don't come apart. They're a really cute set. Okay. So, the second thing that I got was another historical outfit. You're only allowed to get one, so I overflowed into my sister's historical outfit limit because she didn't buy any. This wasn't on the price list, so I was really surprised to see that this was there and that it made it to the second day. I had to pick it up. I was so glad that it was there. It's Addie's Be Forever Me outfit. I got it for $10, so that was a really good deal. 
with her blue dress. Black boots. These boots remind me of Rebecca's boots. Oops. Plain white socks. That's all that came in that set. The last outfit I got is the Joyful Jewels outfit. I got it for $8. This was a holiday outfit last year, I think. This red dress with the tool underneath it and the knot. This actually surprises me. The jewels are underneath the little, like, lacy layer here. So they're actually not on top. I didn't notice that in pictures. It's still cute red headband. It has a huge tag on it, as per usual. I'll probably cut that off. A little decoration on it. And these shoes. I love these black shoes, you guys. They're so cute. The little gem on the side. They can be used for so much. They match everything. I love them. Okay, and... So you've all been waiting for this moment. I've been waiting for this moment, too, where I can open the doll that I got. The doll that I got was Caroline, and she is recently retired, as you probably know, but she was available for $100 the first day, but I got her for 75 the second day. I actually managed... Oh, if I can get this open. I actually managed to get a Caroline with a hairnet in her hair on the second day. I was not expecting to be able to get one like that, but um, my sister actually spotted one when we were looking at them in the stack behind the tables. There were none on the tables with their hair net in, but so we tracked on a volunteer and asked her to go and get the doll from back there for us, and she was more than happy to help. So that's how I wound up with a Caroline with a hair net in. The gorgeous hair. I'm not going to take her hair net out right now, just because I don't know if I'm ready to yet. I love her hair so much. I'm really looking forward to her hair, actually. But, blue eyes, pink dress. I'm so happy that I was able to get Caroline. She's such a pretty doll. Well, that was the last thing in this video, so that's what we got at the benefit sale. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you want to see what was at the benefit sale, we have pictures up on our blog. We'll link it below. So take a look at that.